Is, is this good for the mic? I'm just gonna do it. There's a lot of people off right now. It's the closest I could get. Let's just get into it. Alright. Damn. Fully system activate. King Milton the third. I mean, they're all <laughs> two-dimensional. <laughs> Still good. Milton Finch in the magic paintbrush. Oh, oh my! <laughs> Got some artistic skills there. How big is this thing? I don't have this many pages in my composition book. How many hours? That, that thing did not look that big. Okay. I was four when Milton disappeared. Damn, look at this place. Look at some artistic potential. Trial and error. Mom spent months searching for my brother. Then she sealed the doors. Missing kid posters, so that might attract unwanted attention from older people. Whatever Milton had found in the house, Mom didn't want it getting out. Did she find his porn novels? I'm just making sure I'm not supposed to be anywhere else. What's that? Oh, top. Wait, there's an upstairs. Melton! definitely blamed Just... Edie, but I think Lewis blamed Maybe himself. After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room. Until yeah. Mom got him a job at the cannery. Teenagers have... Hey, they're asocial. How do you... F How big is this house? How many... <laughs> there's a boat. There's a... It doesn't stop going up. This is. I don't know if they say awesome or just. What? How many houses are here? Okay, okay, okay. Lift! Go, go. Each room just makes me depressed on my own. Lewis's room smelled very, very familiar. That part of him lived on. In, in a good way or marijuana? <laughs> very good way. Well, no wonder I'm so happy now. Lewis and I spent a lot of time Hungry. playing games together, but he was surprisingly bad at them. He died a lot. Have you seen me play? I, I just die. Dude, this is the ultimate gamer setup. It's even better than mine. I need a face cam. You'll be a better YouTuber than I am in the next week. You already got the fan base. Dear Mrs. Finch, as Lewis's psychiatrist, I can understand your desire for an explanation. As I see it, the trouble began in January, blah, blah, blah. shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. Newly sober, I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. This is your ther- this is your therapy? He kept working at the cannery. But he was- Wow, I wonder why he had psychological issues. In our sessions, I saw the same behavior. Maybe one of these was his friend. His mind began to... Put your hand in there. Oh, we can do it. Okay, wait. I'm supposed to grab that? Or... Grab the weed! Hey. Wanda. Oh, okay, it's just supposed to control... Oh, it's a... Okay. I asked him to describe it. I want to. He said to. he started small. Imagining a labyrinth. 
Okay. Yay. He'd feel his way about. Whee! Then something moved. Bats. Which way? And well, fuck the bats. Okay then. I right, supposed to go up here. Whoa. And things that have not names. Dragon. Oh. Throw the fish away, you idiot. He knew it was all in his head. No. Really? But he took it very seriously. Right. I had hoped he'd find himself. Uh, in the red room or what? Is a why is this I will shove you harder if I need to. But he found something more. Okay. Wait, was I worried about down? him then. Daydreaming at the cannery. Come on. Another fish. I spoke with his boss. Yeah, but well, I'll put his boss he in said here too. Had become a model employee. <laughs> Sorry, I'll shut up. Methodical, tireless, focused. A whole new Lewis. So hey. I let him go on. I even encouraged him. It seemed very promising at first. What am I playing? <gasps> oh, puppy! I name you. Wish I name you. On the edge of a city, he named oh, come Lewis on. Toby. Snowball. I did not do that. He built the city up slowly, brick by brick. Then he made musicians. I'm seeing Monty Python flashbacks. What type of cannon cat? What type of clicks kind is this? He talked about starting a band. Why do you have these people at potato sacks over always them? humming something. Every day his imagination grew stronger. Yeah, I can see that. He no longer spoke at the cannery. I hit his someone. was as reliable as ever. Then one day it struck him that all the cheering crowds, even the stones under his feet, were all in his imagination. So he could do whatever he wished. Except for, except for stopping he held an early. election for men. You can do every one you're in your imagination you choose to have an actual mayor they begged him to stay but his mind was already wandering it became a game for him okay he conquer a city then immediately push on is no one just gonna ask you why I'm cutting fish at the same time for some reason don't crash, don't crash. I suck at sailing. St. Louis. I'll fucking kill them all. He started drifting away from our reality. <laughs> Minneapolis. Until one day he forgot to go home from the cannery. Even as his mother pleaded with him, part of Lewis kept sailing on. Can I kick, can I put her in here? Mom, look at the fish. I tried to mummy. You're next. In Lewisburg, he heard rumors of a... Do I get the pork? Handsome queen. Eh, I could've gotten the... The uh, rainbow route. Sorry. The queen was on her own quest for 
serpents. Sinister serpents. These are the least sinister serpents I've ever, I've ever seen. He followed the sound of her. Electric guitar. Electric sitar. Now oh, whatever. His chase led him to a golden palace east of the sun and west of the moon. Where he crashed. Even then, his logic remained sound. This is sound? He knew the world was all in his imagination. Like that prince's ass? But he was so proud of having created what the it. Fuck! In his own eyes, he'd become something greater than a king. <laughs> For someone who'd never known success in the I am the queen, the king of fish. Okay. And then it struck him. That the real Lewis was not the one chopping salmon, but the one climbing the steps of a golden Thank God, palace. can I stop the salmon now? Maybe throw the princess off the roof. I, I, I'd rather my not be married to that. My imagination is person. as real as my body, he told me. It was hard to argue with him. Oh, thank God. Oh, where the hell am I now? Is this his workstation? Oh, Lewis, what did you do? He began to forget the world we know. I think uh, it pained him to remember Lewis, the cannery worker. How is that helpful? Hey, Lewis. Nice hobbies you got here. He began to despise the man with a royal contempt. Fuck yeah, him, we're going. Even after he said he was being crowned king over all the lands of wonder. And again, another the palace would be coming. packed with his companions. Stop. Wow, medieval. Uh... This is pretty high tech from medieval times. Treadmill here. Oh no, I'm not getting married to this little girl. <laughs> she would literally crush me in bed. His queen waited. Holding his crown. No! No! Oh no! No, no! Oh, can you see the size of that? There's only one thing left to do. Hello, you do? I'll give her one of you guys. Alright, Bend down. Oh, god, the face. The gang of faceless men. Hey, do any of you guys have a question? Holy shit! <laughs> wow, you guys uh, have a pretty uh, weird 
here for one thing, people. Your son was a kind man who will be missed by all of us who knew him. Thank you. So we cut off his head. My serious. Thank you. <laughs> I chopped off your son's head, but my condolences. My brother was really cool. I wish you could have met him. Yeah, he was a little uh, winded at the moment. Wow. Well, thank you guys for watching. <laughs> I guess I'll do it for this episode. <laughs> I don't know how much. I don't know how long this game actually is. Might be a long one. Might not be. The, I, it's as big as this freaking house is, and we're never gonna end it. See you next episode. Bye. Bye. Bye.